Hey, Crash here, and today we're going to talk about lane position again. The reason we're talking about lane position the second time is because this is a real problematic thing for people. They get hung up on always and never. You're going to catch me, I never say never, and I almost always never say always. I mean, I, I don't never say, ah, screw it, here's the deal. There is no one absolute. In other words, there is no perfect answer. Every situation is different, which means that every situation may require a different action, a different answer, a different way to deal with it. So when people tell you, always be here and never do that, they're wrong. Because sometimes you may have to. Let's take a look at an example first. This is a wacky little intersection, and I've chosen to be the right-hand, left-hand turn lane. Right hand, left. Yeah, I'm going to be right here. The reason I'm right here is very simple. I've got room on the left, and I've got room on the right. I also have a really nifty escape route if something goes weird behind me. Another nice thing about this position is, if the guy beside me goes wide, I bail out into the 7-Eleven's parking lot. Now, there's a danger from the oncoming traffic. If someone runs this light, they're going to hit me. I don't have anyone shielding me on the right side, which would be a benefit of being in the left-hand lane. However, for me, I like my view here better. I can see everything. There's not a car on the right blocking my vision. Yeah, it's simple geometry for me. This is that crap they taught you in high school. Circles are the space around you. How much room do you have? What can you see? Rectangles or squares, you decide, are cars or any other thing that will block your vision, which means that it's going to cut a triangle out of your field of vision. And, worst of all, they all move constantly. Yeah, so you have to be aware. Leave yourself an out. Make sure that you can see where you're going. Make sure you have the best vision you can with the most space you can possibly have. You're probably going to be okay. Remember, this is a changing equation, so don't let perfect be the enemy of good. Do the best you can, and you'll be okay. That's it for me. Be safe.